everybody, this is Praxis. Back on site today, my dad came again uh, and he's finishing up the stairs that we uh, began the other day. There was a little bit of an, uh, a confusion when we were doing the first, they're called stringers, these diagonal pieces with all the steps cut out of them. Uh, in putting the first stringer together, there was just a very minor uh, measurement issue that caused the whole thing to be off. And we're, we've got razor thin margins in terms of the building codes here. In fact, you know, if you saw one of my earlier videos, you, you know, we, we're just a little bit beyond with the margins, but we accidentally went a little further than that. So we had to kind of redo things, but everything's together now. And the piece that we cut for that had that issue, we we're still able to use it by just thinning it out a little bit. And uh, we're going to use that for the center stringer. Uh, the last place I, I had only had two stringers, you know, just one on either side. Uh, Sometimes you see three, or sometimes you'll even see four put on there. I think that the third one's kind of a little bit of an overkill situation. So, I, you know, the fact that it's a little bit thinner because of that issue doesn't bother me in the least because, like I said, the last place I had just two, they're totally fine. Plus, these, uh, these stairs are going to be held up in a lot of places by a wall and posts and all these other things are going to be supporting them. So, I don't think we have any worries, you know, in terms of the, the strength of the stairs. Also going on today, uh, you can see up here we're finishing off the stud wall that goes uh, in there. We were finally able to get absolute confirmation. Though I guess we just got another opinion, but it's an opinion that we like, so we're, we're giving. Yeah, so it's like confirmation bias. <laughs> it agrees with what we'd like to be true again, so we're like, oh, okay, well that must be the way it is. Um, uh, found out that the doors here, uh, going into a bedroom, uh, the minimum is two foot six is fine for that. There was some question as to whether or not it needed to be bigger than that. And also the distance from the stairs, what we were doing is 16 inches and that's totally fine. I think you said it could actually have been smaller than that, yes? Yep. Yeah, so it's nice feeling to have uh, certainty when you're putting stuff together. I really dislike uncertainty uh, in general. I, I work within it all the time. But uh, I, it always bugs me when there's uncertainty about things that should be certain. Like, you know, what's the law regarding X, Y, or Z? That really bugs me, and it's nice that we have certainty on that uh, now. So that's all getting put together. Uh, and then beneath you, uh, you can see over the floor, perhaps, you can see there's a grid, kind of a mesh grid. The concrete people were here first thing this morning. We got the entire bottom all set and prepped and ready for the concrete to come in. They put uh, down all the mesh. We got the edges. The whole periphery is all uh, set up. Wherever there's something passing through, we got foam wrapped around it. I'll uh, bring it down there possibly uh, tomorrow and you know, over all that kind of stuff. There's been a lot of things happening on, happening on every level of the construction today and uh, it's a really positive feeling things are really starting to come together and just seeing those stairs right there it just gives me a, a warm feeling inside and I don't mean parasites that's it thanks for watching